Hello everyone! Welcome back to Cozy Corner. Today we're going to unbox this Moon Ritual Lux box, which is a limited edition box from Goddess Provisions. Goddess Provisions is based in the United States. They offer monthly box with tools to help us connect with our Divine Feminine and grow our spiritual practice. You can expect to see a mix of 5 to 7 products in each box. All items are vegan and cruelty free and also they plant a tree for each box sold with Trees Organization. So they offer free shipping to the United States but they ship worldwide as well and it took 3 weeks to arrive here. This limited edition box costs 77 US dollars. It's quite expensive, especially with the 25 US dollars delivery fee. But I really love the holographic logo and the patterns. Over here it says Sync with the Moon. This easily becomes one of my favorite box packaging of all time. I would prefer it if they didn't stick the address label here though, but I would keep the box no matter what. It's too beautiful. Now, let's open up this baby. See, even the inside has this holographic patterns and logo. So, this is what it looks like inside. The box is small, so it's quite packed with self-care goodies that is related to moon rituals. First off, we have this full moon ritual bath. It has bath salts, rose petals, lavender. I'm sure I'm gonna enjoy this. It smells amazing and I really love to enjoy some bath products. The second item is this Let Go Aura Spray by Bali Pura. It was made with volcanic spring water and infused with some crystals it didn't come with any like mini crystals inside so yeah so you just need to spray it above your head and around you to release some blocked energy and refresh your spirit It smells amazing, but I'm not sure how to like describe the smell to you. <laughs> The third item is this Moth Selenite Palm Stone by Fractalista Designs. The Luna Moth represents transformation and the cycle of life. 
The three lunar phases honor the divine feminine's evolution from maiden to fertile caregiver to wise crone. It is advised to meditate with it to appreciate how you've grown and where you are now. Doesn't this look so beautiful? I haven't seen any like crystals that looks like this. And the fourth item is this Dark Moon Ritual Candle by Cottage Wicks. This soy wax candle has Amazonite, Lava Rocks, and biodegradable glitter on top. It smells amazing and it's so citrusy. I really love the smell and this is used to purify space and clear mind. Even better. The fifth item is this inhaler by Madison and Green. You can see some cedarwood, some sweet orange peel, and some type of herbs here. It smells amazing as well. It can help to relieve anxiety and support focus. So this bamboo thing looks like the one that we use to like steam those dim sum or just store those dim sum. And some say that this looks like a waffle, which is quite accurate too. So the sixth item is this Crescent Moon Ring by Hyochi Jewels. Hope I'm pronouncing this correctly. This stone is a clear quartz stone with this silver plated brass ring. It looks beautiful, but up close you can see some like rusty feeling to it. Um, so yeah, I'm not really that satisfied with this though. The seventh item is Moonlight Oracle Deck by Tatiana Vedenkina. You can draw one or more cards to receive guidance from the moon, the cosmos, crystals, and powerful goddess archetypes. It has a little guidebook inside, but I'm not going to show you in today's video. So I'll just make another separate unboxing and walkthrough video when I get the time to go through it. The illustration looks amazing though. I love how simple they looked. And here we have an introductory card where, where they introduce what's inside the box. And it also comes with this link to a digital file. But it's already past the Aquarius season when I get the box. So it's actually of no use for me. This box also comes with a complimentary gift card that says Certified Goddess and a coupon code as well.
We also have some holographic stickers of different moons such as strawberry moon and also moon faces. I'm not sure where to stick this though. Probably in one of my notebooks or like on a case cover of my laptop. And here we have a moon goddess magnet where I'm gonna stick to my fridge probably. Anyway, I'm loving everything inside the box. It's just that the price and also the delivery fee is out of the world. And it took me like three weeks to get this. So um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get their monthly box. Probably not, but we'll see. Maybe they will have another like theme box that I'm interested in getting again. So that's about it guys. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys next Sunday. Bye!